Yo, YouTube, this is insane. So there's literally a, I don't know if it's a glitch, an exploit, or just a clever use of game mechanics, but whatever it is, you are able to transfer your gold essentially from arena, like the quests, into tournaments and into other arena matches, meaning you can instantly upgrade or instantly buy exotic weapons during tournaments. And it's not really, you can't really visibly see your gold in replay, which means there's gonna be a bunch of teams that are just instantly upgrading to purple weapons or buying exotics like the Nighthawk, the, the RPG, the Boom Sniper, instantly in FNCS today. And so I'm gonna show you how to do that. Not to do it, I'm gonna show you how to do it. But don't do it. I'm, gonna, I'm not gonna show you. I'm not gonna do it. I'm not encouraging you to do it. This is how you do it. Make sure to like the video, leave a comment down below on what your thoughts are on it. Cause I need that YouTube algorithm kick in. So there's this crazy gold bug right now. That uh, gold has to be disabled, basically. I think anyway, cause this is insane. The way that gold works, right, is there's quests that last just for this match. They last 60 minutes. And the thing is that you can definitely do this in FNCS today. Which means teams could be doing this for the past several weeks, too. Where they could have been getting instantly gold. So they could just instantly get purple tax, purple scars anywhere near an upgrade. Yo, chap, you gonna do this exploit today? Because I guarantee you other teams are. You ready? So you just grab the quest and leave, and that lasts 60 minutes. So there's two other guys that I'm going to go to. I knew about this already. Yeah, so did I, but it, then what, see, see this thing, chap, it's like you just deny. You got to deny that you knew this already, because then, you, you know, why didn't you report it? I have these images too. Shows you what drops what. But yeah, in a trio of NCS, I would have one guy always, you know, in an arena trio game, whatever you're doing, go check this guy, then check this guy, have someone else check the wood guy, have someone check the guy down there, bada bing, bada boom, you get it all done. Beautiful. All right, but anyway, there's quests that you can get bottom right that are just harvest metal or stone. And the crazy part is you can pre-do them. So you get, like, if you need to collect, like, 200 metal, like, you can collect, like, 199. And then hop into the next game and just instantly get it. I think he spawns here. He didn't spawn. Like, bro, you are effing me. It's always when you try to show something that, like, it just, the game just doesn't want you to do it. Honestly, the best way to do it is probably actually loot and just go around and grab the quests in one game. No, 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 no. It's not, that's not the point, chat. I'm looking for the ones that I can actually just do... How do I describe it? Like, bro, are you for real? I'll check Caddy, but I don't know if Caddy has 60 minute quests. Yeah, but is that 60 minutes or is it that match, chap? That's my, that's what I'm asking you. Cause you can stack 60 minute quests. So, like, right now, chap, like, you could go grab, like, for Steamy, I would go Weeping Woods, get the collect building materials. I would go get the bottom right guy. So, he didn't spawn, so there's other spawn points over here, which is guaranteed. And then you get gold off spawn enough to double upgrade. So, like, I landed there. He didn't spawn, so you'd hop into this game. I don't know what this guy does. We could check it. Oh, dog. So, yeah, if you land near anywhere with, you know, like, stick your head out of a vehicle or a window. I'm not going to do that right now, but I think that's 60 minutes, right? What's the gold for? So, the gold's good for upgrades. It's good for buying exotics, whatever you want, really. So, like, you talk to this guy. Uh, harvest metal. And the crazy thing is, right, like, I could stack this. So, like, 200 metal. So, if I farm, like, 160. If I go into, like, an Evan CS game, I'll just immediately be able to get all that gold. 
See, so I still have drive a boat. I still have. Oh no, no, stick your head out's only for that for that match. So you have to pick the quests that have the 60 minute timer. All right. Let's see if I can get the the weeping one. If I get the weeping one, then we're set. But you can see, like, I'm in a new game, and I still have harvest metal and drive a boat, which is a 200 gold. So if I'm landing a waffle bar, I immediately get 200 gold. Like, I'm getting... It's 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 so stupid. Like, if you land on an upgrade, like, if I land tomato head... Like, for example, there's a gnome that spawns in the castle that's break three slurp barrels. So, like, let's say you land slurpy. Let's say you land waffle. Let's say you land craggy. That gets you 200 gold instantly for breaking one slurp barrel, right? Because you just pre-break two. And then people wouldn't even know if you don't stream. Because you just break a barrel and you get gold. And in replay, it doesn't show you get gold. So the only way that you would know people are doing this is if you take the time to slowly count all the gold that they actually got. So this is like a stealth tactic that people could be using to cheat. Hope this guy spawns, man. Man, they don't want to see me win in here. I mean, I guarantee you people were abusing the hell out of this all, all day. All week. Every week of Evan's CS so far, I guarantee you people were abusing this. Like, 100%. Everyone that had god tax, like, I guarantee you, they were accidentally just getting an insane amount of gold. Because think about it, if you land, let's say you land Dam for RPG, let's say you land anywhere where there's an upgrade or, like, Chug Splashes, like, you could just have it to, like, you just guarantee you can buy them. So, like, I'm gonna go check if Pepper... And, uh... Well, the wood guy had to have spawned, but he didn't spawn there. But Tomato Head might. Okay, so clicks girl spawn. So like you gotta see fuel up a vehicle, so that's 60 minutes as well. So now if I just put gas in a vehicle in any game. See my boy Tomatoes here. Tomatoes here as well. So we'll grab that. What's up, Mr. Tomato Head? Consume peppers. Okay, thanks, man. These are all 60 minute quests, which means come up in CS, you do this beforehand, all of a sudden, these people have full upgrades. You're like, huh, how did I get all this gold? You got them for about two games? Well, that's the thing, right? Is that couldn't I just drop in and have my other two teammates do the exact same thing? Two of them land at, you know, the one guy's spawn, I land at the other. If he doesn't spawn, one of them has it. Cause you could just you do it again, right? In the middle of a tournament, all of a sudden, whoa, oh, why are they cute in Arena Trito? Talk to this guy. Look at this. Harvest wood. 120. Alright, so now. <clears throat> so now Evan CS is starting. We're queuing up. Let's go, guys. We're about to pop off. Yeah, so you'd only take one quest from each NBC, right? So sometimes when you go see, you're like, oh, the NBC doesn't have any quests. That's because you already have one. So, like, look, I still have Harvest Wood and Harvest Metal. They're about to be done. It's like, you just immediately upgrade. Even if you die off spawn, as long as you don't use that, you're, you're, you're golden. So, like, let's say you're fighting someone off spawn at Tomato, Right? Like, it, it's it's just so broken to its core. Because, like, let's say, like, right now, right? You're landing at Evan CS, and, you know, you're fighting a team. They land, You land Orchard, they land Tomato, and you're like, oh, like, this should be free. But the upgrade spawned there, and now they have instant gold. And you're like, how the hell do they all have purple tax right now off spawn? We're getting on because they have purple weapons. Will people be getting banned for this, I think? I don't know. I think it's, it's you know, it's definitely, uh, it's like he didn't spawn, of course. Whatever, though. We'll add up another quest to our, our mix here. Like, I don't even care if this guy kills me. Oh, let's collect apples at the orchard. So that actually does not do anything for me unless I landed at orchard. Yeah, I'm just gonna land waffle. But now, like, if I rotate into orchard, even if the NPC's dead, I can still get that gold. I don't think it works in tourneys, though. 
Uh, it definitely will work because like you can go to customs and do it. 100% will work. It's like, it's clearly using the way that Epic has designed the game, but the way that Epic has designed this is absolutely broken. So like, it's, it's super gray area, which is why a lot of people knew about it and didn't, you know, say anything. Because it, obviously the things that help you win, you don't, you don't snitch. I'm using the game just like using middle orb to out heal zone. Yeah, but it's even worse than that because like you're using that goal to potentially kill other players with an advantage of your guns. Oh, I got to open it up. Oh, look at that. I have 80 more gold. I was just trying to open up Waffle, you know? I wasn't doing anything weird, guys. Like, can you not snipe me in the video, bro? Oh, farming metal, you know? Just how I do. Oh, look at that. I got more gold now. Just farming some wood. Oh, look at that. I got more gold now. Oopsie. Huh, I have 300 gold already. The game just started. Interesting, huh? If I had a pepper, I'd have 120 more gold. See? You have to think about it like this, too. So many people are accidentally doing it that they they, it's, they don't even know. They're just like, oh, I have gold? Because, like, they're playing pubs. They picked up a quest. They're like, I'm not fueling up a car today. Like, I'll do it later. And then they go into Evan CS. Someone's like, yo, fuel up our car. Fuel up our car. And then all of a sudden, they're like, wait, I can upgrade. I have 500 gold. You're like, what? Feels like so much like cheating. I guarantee you the people that qualled over us with one point that use that, they don't feel like it's cheating. I'm sure they just, they're like, ha, ha, ha. We're so smart. So the question is, is it cheating? I don't know. Is it in the game? Yup. So this guy didn't spawn. So I'm gonna fight some jabroni trying to go to my retail class. But like I said, like, let's say like, okay, like, you know, we have like so many games left. Let's just pause. I'm gonna go Q into arena solo. Phase mongrel. You don't need an arena. Do it in an actual pub. I think that's pretty, uh... I don't know if that's true. But I also think that's pretty obvious. Huh. Mongro Mitro just queued up for a regular duo. Mid FNCS. It's so like, once again, I still have the fuel up a vehicle quest. Like... I'm pretty sure, right? Yeah, I still have eat peppers and fuel up a vehicle. Yeah, I, I don't know if it's intended, but I mean, hey, if you're trying to get some gold this Evan CS today, I would say, you know, hey, get some free upgrades, man. Other teams are going to be doing it. Enjoy, man. Like, in, in an ideal world, you just get all the quests, leave, and then you have a 60-minute timer to do them. So, like, right now, like, I still have 44 minutes left on filling up a vehicle for gold. I still have 44 minutes on the uh, the peppers. Tried to kill me. Man, you kids are weird as hell. Alright. It's so like once again, right? I still have my Eda peppers. So like, let's get some gold. Boom, just got my gold. Once again, game just started. I'm already at 270 gold. I still have fuel up a vehicle. I have the quests above me. It's so, like people could be doing it subtly too, so like, you don't even realize. You're like, wow. Grab a bounty. Cons different weapon types. So you just drop, pick up your weapons. Boom, I have 300 gold. Consumes apples or bananas. Two apples, a banana. Go up four or five. Boom. Chow down. Look at that. The game just started. The waffle team, guess what? Hey. GG's, everybody. Got Storm Scout off spawn, boys. Where are we going? I'm going to go get some Surge.